Adam, let's continue our coverage about the relief efforts in Puerto Rico. There was a state of emergency that is still effect on the island and just moments ago, right before the show started, a 5.4 earthquake shook the island of Puerto Rico. Thousands are without power, water and food. And Chef Alejandro Perez, he knows, he knows how this is. He works with the World Central Kitchen and he believes that he can help people. He lived through Maria and now he is using his talents in the kitchen to help his fellow Boricuas go to bed with at least a full stomach. So I was a chef previously before Maria. After Maria, um, most of the chefs lost their jobs um, and we didn't have much to do. So we did the next best thing we knew how to do. We started cooking with Jose Andres as soon as he got here um, and the rest has been story. How did your family fare in the earthquake? Are you guys okay? So most of my family is from North Bayamon, San Juan area. Um, and then we're fine, but down south, I have some family members that don't even want to be inside their house. After Maria happened and there was so much devastation, did you see this greatness coming into your life in terms of traveling and being able to help people out around the world? When Maria happened, we didn't know what 15,000, 25,000 meals looked like as a chef. Uh, so yeah. it was a learning experience for all the chefs that were there. Every activation is completely different because we take in consideration the culture of every activation that we do. What does that mean exactly? So it's not the same food everywhere we go, right? Do you mind showing me around some of the food that you've made so I can see some of the pork dishes that are there? We have the sandwich line. So we have jamón y queso y que otra? Oh, so that's our secret sauce. We call it secret sauce. Okay, well, I'm going to need to know what's in the secret sauce. <laughs> it's basically mayo and ketchup. Oh, mayo ketchup. Duh. Yeah, which Puerto Ricans invented. Of course. <laughs> Yesterday on our Instagram poll, 20% of you said that you have been to the island of Puerto Rico. Just 20%. But also 20% of you told us that you've donated to the relief efforts. And for that, I am so grateful. Because with the earthquakes and aftershocks continuing to hit the island, I don't know what you're going to find intact the next time you do visit. But what I do know is that the carne frito and the mayo ketchup, that will definitely be there to greet you.